This video is created to help you add personal information to your Blackboard account. First thing you want to do is log in. Here you'll find three columns. The left hand column is the Blackboard Tool column. The center column is the Institutional Announcement column and the Course Announcement column and for the most part you will ignore this center column. Then the right hand column is the column where you will find your course and you click on the title of your course in order to enter it and fully enter the course site. But we're here today to edit our personal information. So we're going to come under Tools and click on Personal Information, Edit Personal Information. All I put in here about you is your first and last name and your email address. So you may want to add more. You may want to share your gender or your birth date. You might want to share your city and state and or state. You can share either or. So I've put that a little bit more personal information in about myself and now I'm going to click Submit and enter that personal information. Now the next thing I need to do is change my privacy options so that other people can see this. So it is checked. Or I checked to make sure my email address can be seen by other people. I changed my city and state so I'm going to check that box as well. I didn't change a phone number or work information. Um, I don't want to be listed in the user directory. That's a college-wide um, choice. You don't need to do that. And then I just click Submit, and that allows other people to see my email address, my city and state that I put in. Um, the other thing you might want to do in personal information is to change your password. This is actually a very good idea. It's actually a very good idea um, to pick a password of your own choosing and then write it down somewhere because when you take another course from Be a Disciple I'm not going to change this password. This password will stay the same unless you email me and tell me you need your password to reset and then in that case I can put it back. Now to go back to that place where we logged in and we came to the place where uh, it was our login page, we had the three columns, we could go to our course, we want to click on My Blackboard and this is your Blackboard your own personal Blackboard account. And I'm going to enter the course site and so I'll click on the title of the course in, in order to fully enter the course site. And that's how you add personal information.